We are a city of big dreams, and we have what it takes to make our dreams come true. And if you doubt any of that, look at this, a kid from Tasha in Dorchester, who is now mayor of this great city. Boston's earned its reputation. This is a city that started the revolution that gave us a nation. We fought tyranny. We stood up to slavery. We opened the doors to immigrants. And when our gay and lesbian neighbors remind us of the rights they were now being denied, we backed up their fight and helped the Commonwealth become the first to protect those rights in law. We must redouble our efforts and recommit ourselves to the safety of every citizen in our city. We will do that today and every day I am mayor of this city. No parent should worry that a bullet will stop a daughter or son from coming home. No woman should be scared in our streets. No senior should be afraid in their home. And no child should be forced to live with trauma and the indelible scars of violence. <laughs> study after study has told us that universal early education and these other changes can be transformative. They give every child a more equal chance to thrive and succeed. Yes, these things cost money, but we must find a way. Education spending is the biggest piece of our city budget. So when we start with this principle, every dollar we spend on education must be put to the best and most effective use. <laughs> Different pieces of the economic development puzzle are spread across city government. Too often, it's hard to fit them together. There's duplication and confusion. It's difficult for the city and for businesses and workers trying to make it work. I am committed to restructuring the Boston Redevelopment Authority and to bring together a smart, rational, effective way so all the parts of city government and job creation work for the consumer and for the business community. We have a responsibility to every generation. Too many of our seniors are struggling. Too many of our seniors face, dif face difficulties they can't overcome on their own. It's time we really understand the problems they face so we can find solutions. We will release and examine closely a new comprehensive report on Boston seniors about where and how they live, employment and income, nutrition and health, mobility and language. I will work to create the new City Ethics Committee so we can establish and enforce stronger ethic rules and more disclosure for city elected officials and senior level employees. <laughs> Faith and trust are earned. We must do what it takes to earn both from the people we serve. Together, we have much to do and a lot of hard work ahead.